They're on Skull Cowboy Max 2, and the last time, uh, this guy just got poisoned all the time, but we all know what kind of animal just loves eating poison all day. Moths, like they just can't stop. It's really weird. We're kind of running out of poison in certain parts of land because we just got moth morphing about, doing patty cakes, and taking all the poison. We're going to the junkyard! I like the music here. And uh, yeah, welcome to the junkyard. Check out this is B. That's I think that's B from uh, Mega Man X2. I don't know. We got these quite morbid, like just hanging robot faces. Like, honestly, this place would be hella weird and morbid for someone to visit. There's a secret something if you use a little sound. Okay, first of all, you need to kill eh, these guys, okay? See, if you kill them, you lose their head. It's super awkward for everyone. All right. You, be frozen so that I can use your frozen body to get a what up! No, so it hurt! I am full of juices and electrical might! Uh, okay, this is just weird, so yeah, there's magnets. You see, they fall down, though, and they're okay. They're just pretending to be dead. It's not that morbid, even though you can see, like, you know, dead carcasses of robots everywhere. See, this guy's a Metal and those wheel enemies from Mega X1, and, like, the head of what might be the Ruboro snake. I'm actually not sure. These guys are like, whatever, man. Your thing is so fancy with your... Disc throwing, disc Joe's just not that impressive to me. I'm sorry, you know what? Maybe I am making a mistake. Maybe I should just go through you like this. How you feel about that, huh? I'm being the most impolite that I can muster. And it's working fine. All right, there we go. That's how you beat the game. Please heed the special tricks in mind. Oh yeah, this this guy's pretty cool since you got this big robot over there. It's like, oh no! The weird little hoppy flea went inside a robot, now it's activated. You gotta just shoot in a hole because it's made of unbreakable material somehow. And that's all it took, so now it's gonna free up. So I'm like, hey, check it out! It's me, I'm the actual boss. Whoa, and I like to hop. I like to hop. And then I fly, I got wings, and I play like an idiot. I just can't, like focus or shoot wherever I want, it's like, I rise again! <laughs> oh, what? Oh, you got awkward angle jump. That's pretty cool. Most powerful weapon in all the land. Right there. Okay, like, dude just takes a few, a couple of bullets to shoot, but then it's like, you gotta kill the main body. And the main body, you know, takes a bullet or two sometimes. But dude, that's my crystal shape gun. So here we got viruses, like the same guys, except, you know, they're, they're, they're pink instead of green, except the opposite round, because I only express myself through... I forgot to see if this was a stage with the next hunter. I completely just skipped my mind to even check. I think that's where they hang out in this this level? Oh boy, I honestly don't know. Can I even make it there with what I have? See, I don't think I can. <laughs> I forgot about that. Yeah, yes, you can. Very easily at that. Hey, friend. Let's see. Yep, there's an X hunter here. Uh, who is it gonna be though? My health isn't great. Surge. I don't know. He has a fancy. He Surge or Surges? Surge plural. I have no idea. Stop the unification! That sounds pretty scary it's for the good of all! Oh, it's good of all. Oh no, escape. So his deal is that he does this, and he looks like an idiot. There we go. I, I, that's the boss. And he falls on his butt. And he looks like an idiot. Mine's on the ground. You probably want to get rid of him. Just, just a heads up. He's got a pretty fancy shield, and it's like, Check it! I don't know what I'm doing! Well, me neither, Ben. Friend. Uh, yeah, can you shoot the lines? You can, okay. I should probably do that. Just, just a thought. So I'm probably gonna die the way this is going. I got a lot, okay, well. Got a lot of lives. I completely forgot. I think they have boss weaknesses, but I don't know where they are. Uh, this might not be an impossible fight. Like, an improbable fight, maybe, considering I didn't have a lot of health coming in. Like, if I had all my health, dude. There you go. Well, yeah, I kind of saw that one coming, honestly. This was more of a, what is going on, kind of going on.
Ah, damn. So these are viruses and they make you automatically press button. Like this guy was making me jump automatically. I think they're pretty cool. They're like they're pretty cool idea. I don't know, it's I'm having a lot of trouble following the plot. I think it's a little too complicated for me. What dude? How There we go. Not that bad. Not that bad at all, because I can just let his mind. Trick, just leave the mines there. Just concentrate on killing him faster. I delayed the inevitable. Well, you know, we'll meet again. So it's all go. Woo! He goes away. He's just left on his elevator. And I got number part zero one. Let's go. We can now express ourselves uh, by saying either one or two it is the only numbers we will ever need. Let us go straight down this cacophony of follies. Can you get these? It's really awkward to get them. I don't think it's worth it. Check out that sweet guy. He's flying. Whoa! Hey, health. That could have been a pit, but it wasn't. So it's all good. So, yeah, the magnet, like, see how things, you are jumping higher? Like, I think. And then sometimes the magnet, you go the other way around. Now you can you jump lower a little bit. That's pretty cool. You can go up here, though. So you can go all the way up here, up the wall. I'm like, hey, I made it all the way up the wall. Praise me! And it's like, alright, good job. And it's like, yeah, I got praised. It's all swell at the municipal pool. There's some water and maybe some food, but not in the same areas, because not allowed to bring pool in the, in the smoking area. That's pretty weird. Uh, watch out! I want to go down this ladder. You jerk. Viri! You mal malignant. Oh no, spark mandrel roofs. I hope we don't get a monkey surprise. Alright, well, no, I don't want you guys. I have no need for you. Because I gotta refight this excellent sub boss micronation! Whoa, you're so cool, dude! You got a red foot, and a gray foot, and a blue foot, and an orange foot, and I can't jump good, so I can't do damage on you! See, that's where this boss excels, is that you just spent some time destroying his big robot buddy who throws trash at you. But then if you don't do any damage against uh, the parasite, it's, it's, it's pointless. It's, it's, you have done nothing. You have a, it's like, he's really hard to hit. Because it's fine, he's too small, you can't hit him with your normal shots. Unless he's airborne. In which case, you know, then you can make him blow up. And you become sad because, you know, his dream was to just live on as a parasite on a cool robot. But Mega Man, you can't let that happen. It's, it's consciousness will not let him do such a thing. Oh no, it's Killer Kangaroo Robot or whatever. I'm not messing around with you, friends. So I've got infinite lives, so this guy should go well. It's Morph Mott. I'm sure you'll recognize his opening animation from the start of video. Beautiful. Yes, like, his ability isn't so much that he morphs, it's just that, you know, he's literally just currently still in the cryo version. Like, he's still in this chrysalid. And uh, the morph part is just that, you know, at some point, he's gonna be a beautiful moth. But for now, he's just he's a chrysalid, and he's got the power, you know, to just kind of move junk around. As all chrysalids do. Really tired of that cliche. And there, I wasn't supposed to do the full range. But he has a very nice swagging happening. He's like, Ugh, I'm just gonna move left and right, and trash is gonna rule the world! Then you're like, okay, well, well, well. Does it always start the same way? I don't know. Wow. Why am I... 
Oh, jeez. That could have gone bad. That really wanted to go bad. He's like, well, all I can do is rock back and forth. And then he pans on me and crushes me. And I am so sad. Alright, well, you know, this is getting acquainted with Aunt Jeffrey. So here we go! Time for take two. The time of where we forget all about what color of shoes we were wearing that evening. Which means that we become the prime suspect in the murder trial to history without any alibis. Uh, how is the court gonna know that Reindeer to Rudolph uh, is a fictional adventure by Bram Stoker? I don't know. I just... Oof. Hell, I can't play games. And I'm having issues. Uh, doing a lot of things. Thank you for that input, okay. <laughs> Finally, video game world is safe. Oh, he's going the other way. See? How do you know which way he's gonna go? I think you want to go around three times. Four times? Four times. I thought three, because it's a video game. Alright, then he falls down. That's how it land last time. Then he goes way up in the ceiling. It's like... The chrysalis is broken! He is now a beautiful animal! With beautiful lasers and super nice glitter. And a lot of headroom. You really improved the quality of your room there when you uh, pupated. So can you please go lower so I can shoot you in the face? I would appreciate that a lot. Dude is a lot- Whoa! Dude just does a ton of damage. Dude does a ton of contact damage. Like, that, that took me by surprise. Nonetheless, he's significantly more powerful before he does his two children morphing. And I never did point out the beautiful blue of the explosion of these boss. That's you know, no, they're powerful. If they don't just explode, their soul comes out and then their ghosts explode. That's how you know. They mean business. Silk Shot is a pretty interesting weapon because that's not actually what it does. Like, the shot you bring out changes depending on what stage you're in, which is... weird. You know, the weapon morphs, I guess. It's kind of only what's supposed to be the silk. So, you know, we got silk, we got morph, we got butterfly. Most of these animals would eat a butterfly if they could. None of these animals can morph, so we're gonna have to use another attribute to determine who will win. Naturally, the best way to kill a moth is to drown them, and three of these four animals are associated with water, so that only narrows it down a little bit. 